Hey guys and welcome to Minikun Tutorials. In my last uh, review and unboxing video, I um, recommended HP MV laptop. Okay, HP MV 17-CH1056 NF. Okay, model. Okay, I did recommend this for the PC and I'm just doing the follow up uh, to tell you what more I really found interesting about this PC. This video is not sponsored by HP and whatever that I'm saying here is just my personal opinion and uh, just to guide you in case you're also wondering in the PC market as to which PC you should buy. Maybe this PC, I mean this review could help you make your choice all right so once again i really enjoyed i've used this pc so far for seven days it's a 17.3 inches pc um which comes with windows 11 okay actually these are actual pictures of the unboxing that i did and uh, if you want to see the full um, uh, unboxing you can actually check in my channel and you find a video on the unboxing process so but this is how it is and uh i wouldn't go into the details what it is but today i'm just going to tell you some key and very very interesting things about this pc so i will just take you to one of the marketing sites here in france it's called boulanger that's where most people buy their electronic stuff and that's why i got this pc for a thousand two hundred euros and uh i would like to share with you what i really find interesting so that you can also make your choice right also uh think about it whether you also like go for this or something else. that's up to you but i really enjoyed it and it's a very powerful pc as i'm telling you so this is how it is and uh the here are the details once again this is just a reminder we've already discussed this but i'll just remind you um, of what the PC contains. So we are talking about Windows 11 installed. Then the processor is Intel and the core i7, I think 11th generation. You're talking about storage capacity of, that's with regards to the hard drive. You're talking about storage capacity of one terabyte. And then the RAM is actually 16 GB, 16 gig. Okay, so you are talking about RAM of 16 gig. Uh, comes with Windows 11 CPU speed is 2.9 gigahertz and um, you know the battery life that I can't really say but in terms of the battery durability when in use it's about nine almost 10 hours nine hours 45 minutes that's what they say but if you're on the internet doing whatever it will not last up to nine hours you should be expecting six to six to seven hours max and the screen resolution is perfect one good thing i like about 17 inches pcs is the fact that with a 17 inches pc you have the best resolution as compared to a smaller pc so and the screen resolution is actually um led full resolution full hd resolution ips okay so it's the, the imaging is perfect and in addition to this you have nvidia geforce uh, graphic card so this pc is built for gaming the fan may be making a little bit of noise depending on what you are doing if you are doing something that like video editing gaming it makes sense that the fan will be turning uh this fan speed will increase in order to cool this the pc down so that's that makes sense right but apart from that if you are using it for normal stuff like just office work or anything at all you can't even hear any noise from the fan if you are playing game you might hear a little bit of background noise which is normal with almost every pc and uh just that it weighs actually 2.5 kilos and you may not like that's a 17 inches pc so it's normal that it weighs and also the, the chassis is also made of some metallic kind of design 
I think that all accounts for why it weighs 2.5 but and the clock the keyboard i was about to say it in french clavier but the keyboard is very very nice and uh, you really enjoy typing the fact that it's a 17 inches pc so you have you have the keyboard the normal uh, display or whatever placement of the keypads and it's very nice it's a standard keyboard since it's a 17 inches pc this you wouldn't get with maybe a smaller pc and to me 17 inches best suits what I really wanted to do, have best resolution, very large screen, can enjoy my video watching. It's not like a 24 inches PC, so it's, I just enjoy this size of the screen, but that is up to you. If you want a smaller PC that weighs less than maybe 2.5 kilos, then we're going for that. But I think this PC is worth it. And it also comes with a fingerprint. So anyway, let's go to that particular website. Look at how it looks when you this how it really looks, you know. So to me this is just perfect. It's not it's not very huge for me, it's just okay. But I'll take you to that particular website I'm talking about, the French website. I'm not saying you should buy it, buy it from HP Shop, wherever you buy your PCs, do that. But I will just come to this website just to tell you about certain things that Maybe in your shop where you may buy your PC, these extra details might not be given to you and the sellers can actually take advantage of you. So once again, as you can see, in terms of repairability, it has an in this index of uh, 6 on 10, meaning it can be repaired easily, but not very, very easily. And 6 on 10 is not too bad, but you should take very good care of your PC. It comes with Windows 11, as I said, Intel Core 7, i7, GeForce uh, NVIDIA graphic card, which makes, which gives you the best in terms of graphics when it comes to gaming. Screen size is 17.3 centimeters. You have SSD, hard drive of one terabyte, hard disk, I mean, um, set hard disk. A RAM of 16 gig resolution is 1920 by 1080 pixels, and you're talking about um, the battery life of 9 hours 45, Wi Fi 6, Bluetooth comes with it, and the weight is 2.5. What else do I have to tell you? Um, let me just tell you those extra stuff that I wanted to say about this PC. So in case you want to look at how it looks like, let me go back here. In terms of ports, let me tell you about the ports. This is how the PC looks like. Okay. I just wanted to show you certain things about the USB ports and all of that. So this is how the PC looks like. For this showing you, this is how it looks like. So on the one side, you have, I'll actually show you the, the, the anything that has to do with, you have an SD card here, you have two, normal usb a port and then you have your um headphone jack here let's move on as you know, like i told you actually comes with fingerprint or so i'm coming i want to show you in terms of ports okay so like i said let's look at this side first of all you have your sd card here you have one usb port two usb a ports then you have your um, your headphone uh, socket here, or jack or whatever you call it, the headphone jack. And then on the other side, you have no another USB A port, and then you have HDMI for your projection, TV set, and whatever screen you may want to connect. You have what USB Type C port here, and then you have this your a headphone plug or whatever jack here so this is very, very interesting let me get down and tell you about those extra details that i wanted to tell you in fact the first thing that i wanted to remind you of is the fact that this pc comes with a free antivirus it's not just for free it only, you can only it's actually the mac a fee life safe antivirus so i'm not the one as you can see i'm not the one who installed it it came with a PC, 
and um, is the the antivirals recommended by recommended by HP. So if you are like me, I don't like picking styles by heart, you know. So I just wanted to keep the original antivirals, even if what is recommended by HP. I know, of course, HP might be in partnership with with uh, AFI or whatever um, antivirus company. That's why you know. But to me, it's just okay in a sense that I don't want to I don't want to pick any other antivirus that might not be compatible with a pc so you have this advantage and i've used a pc so far for seven days so i still have 23 days of free of charge to use this antivirus and after which i can click on just buy here and let's see how much it'll cost at the moment i can pay 24 25 euros approximately per year which is highly, highly affordable as compared to other antiviruses that will be after 20 after a month you can renew it if you want and in addition to this they also give you uh, free adobe apps for one month i'm sorry this is in french but you also get free adobe apps for one month so if i should come to the search menu here and type adobe i just click on uh, office or whatever adobe of adobe if i click on that you see that i can use any of these uh, adobe apps for free for instance what i like using is adobe acrobat reader dc for office work you can just install it and use it for one month for free any of these and if you want to prolong or extend your license then you can do that but HP offers you this for free for one month. So you have a uh, McPhee, anti McAfee or whatever antivirus for one month, Adobe apps for one month for free. And then you also have MS Office also pre-installed. Let me show you that. So you have also, uh, let's look down here normally. Okay. We also have, uh, Microsoft Office pre-installed for also 30 days. So at the very beginning, when you buy your PC, you have access to Teams, Microsoft Teams, Outlook, and all these other apps that come with, I think, Office 365. So you have everything. And then after a month, you can now decide to extend your license or not. Thank you so much for watching and please subscribe.